Hi, I'm Daniel O'Brien, and since 2010, we've been making mobile chicken sheds. First, we made one for 450 laying hens, and then we made one for 130 laying hens. Both of these models were finalists in the Australian Farm Invention of the Year, with the Chicken Caravan 450 winning the 2012 Farm Invention of the Year. Four years later, in 2016, we were working on something behind the scenes. We got the best features from the two larger models and made it smaller. We were prototyping this unit at a secret location and on the 15th day of August 2016, I did a Facebook Live that went for one minute and 57 seconds. I thought I'd show a short sneak peek of what we were working on. That video got shared over a thousand times and got over 150,000 video views. Since that Facebook Live in August 2016, we have continued to improve all aspects of the Chicken Caravan 30. Over the past five years, the Chicken Caravan 30 has been exported to USA, Norway, Denmark, Japan, New Zealand, Canada, South Africa, Taiwan, United Kingdom, and France. Now you've heard about the history of the Chicken Caravan 30, let me show you the features. So the first thing I want to show you in this setup is this electrified fence. We've got a solar energizer that can electrify this fence. Now we've got foxes on this farm and we know that because we've seen the photos on the wildlife cameras. We've never had a chook taken by a fox because we use this electric fence. Foxes stay on the outside, the chickens stay on the inside. One of the things you'll notice about the Chicken Caravan 30 is the large wide wheels. They're not little and they're not skinny. By having them large and wide means we can go over rough terrain and the unit's not going to get stuck. I'll show you how easy it is to move. We simply push this ramp in, we grab the tow handle and then we can just simply pull the chicken caravan 30 forward. When we've got to the desired location, we lift up the handle that acts as a brake. We just engage this little chain here and that's how easy it is. So on the tow handle, one thing you notice is this little bar that flips out. We flip that out, we put the pin back through, and we've got this hole, and this is a tow ring. This will go over a 50 millimeter tow ball of your ride on lawnmower, your quad bike, or your farm ute, and you can simply put that over your tow ball and use a vehicle to move the Chicken Caravan 30 along slowly. The Chicken Caravan 30 has a large pull-out ramp. This allows easy access for the chickens to go in and come out of the Chicken Caravan 30. So I'll show you inside the Chicken Caravan 30. So this side is where the hens go. You'll see it's got a mesh floor so all the manure can fall straight through the floor. It's got three perches that the chickens can sleep on at night. And then in the back there, that's where they lay their eggs in the nesting boxes. Inside the nesting boxes, we have nesting box exclusion gates. What this means is at night, the nesting boxes close so the hens don't get access to it. If the hens get access to it at night, they can go in there, they can poop, make a mess. That way, when your eggs roll out, they're gonna come out dirty. So it's got built-in exclusion gates so you get clean eggs. The nesting boxes are built on a hinge. That way, if you're on uneven ground, you can simply loosen this T-bolt Move your nesting boxes to the level position, tighten it up, and that way your eggs will always roll away. Okay, so this here is the egg collection area. You fold this down, you've got a nice shelf and a tray to collect the eggs. Now these eggs come from a roll away nesting box. So what you see here, this is where the eggs end up, but the nesting box is on a slope. So when a chicken lays the egg, the eggs roll down and end up here. So they're not in the way of the chickens. The reason a rollaway nesting box is important, if we don't have a rollaway nesting box, a chicken can hop in the nest, tread on an egg, and then you have broken eggshell, white, all over the other eggs. By having a rollaway nesting box, your eggs are safe from any chickens from standing on them. Under the Chicken Caravan 30, it has a built-in feeder. This allows the chickens to get easy access. Also, on the side of the feeder, you see these big rain covers. So if rain is coming in at an angle, it's not gonna wet the feed. The chickens can simply come under there and feed. So in this side of the Chicken Caravan 30, this is the behind the scenes of the nesting box. 
And over here, there's enough room to put a 30 litre water container. You can plug your water container straight into the nipple drinker system, which can feed clean, hygienic water straight through the nipple drinkers. The reason we use nipple drinkers and not a water bowl, a water bowl, the chickens can scratch dirt into it, making it muddy. Having nipple drinkers, the chickens can easily get underneath and drink the water. The Chicken Caravan 30 has an automatic door. So you don't have to remember to lock your chickens in at night. The Chicken Caravan 30 does it automatically. And in the morning, the Chicken Caravan 30 will let your chickens out automatically. The Chicken Caravan 30 has a built-in insulation air pocket built into the roof. If you put your hand on the top of the roof, it's not that hot because the silver reflects a lot of the heat. And underneath, it's actually a different sheet of metal, and right now that's cool. In between those two sheets of metal is an air pocket. This allows the heat of the sun to hit the top of the roof, but it does not permeate in, keeping your chickens cool in summer. So you've seen the automation on the Chicken Caravan 30. It's got automatic nesting box gates. It's got automatic gate to let the chickens out in the morning and lock them away at night. All these systems are controlled by the Chicken Master control box. It's powered by the battery, but don't worry, the battery is charged automatically by the solar panels, which are charged up by the sun. 